regular sea waves caused by the wind are very different to tsunami waves. Let's find out why. Wind blowing over the sea can only move the upper layer of water, forming waves but not affecting movements deeper down. The water particles near the surface move in a circular motion, which helps to propagate the wave along. Deep down, the water particles don't move. The strength with which these waves reach the coastline depends exclusively on the movement in the first few metres of water. A tsunami, on the other hand, can be generated at the bottom of the sea. In the case of a strong earthquake, the seafloor abruptly deforms and vertically displaces the overlying water. The entire water column is disturbed by the uplift or subsidence of the seafloor. This sudden movement releases a great impulse of energy, which is transferred to the entire water column between the surface and the seafloor. In this case, the water deep down moves as well, 